was slightly delayed by John Donesh, who was stuck in Olympic traffic. Um, he took a left at Chelsea, then took a right in Fulham, and took another left, and ended up getting bronze in the women's archery. <laughs> it's wonderful for me to see that a book that is so groovy, written by two of the geekiest guys I yeah. was kind of known. <laughs> a lot of religious books that can be quite woolly, and this book is not. It's filled with images, it's filled with great texts. I find it very entertaining. And I just have to ask you, how did this uh, fantastic project come about? So the book was commissioned by One World, and uh, they commissioned uh, Paul Slaughter, photographer for the LA Olympics, 84 right. Olympics, to travel the world, visited dozens of countries, took photos of people and places relevant to the current Baha'i world and to Baha'i history. And we were asked to add the text to that and to give the book shape. What's very interesting to me, there's a, a section on Baha'i artists here as well. Yul Brynner a Baha'i? I don't think so, but there are lots of rumours about him and Telly Savalas. Telly Savalas. Yeah, anyone yeah. bald? Basically. Yeah, yeah. I, th I, I was very attracted to that idea. Dizzy Gillespie as well? Dizzy Gillespie is probably the best known Baha'i, probably. Well, I refute that. Do you? Why, why did you focus on, on having kind of well-known Baha'is in the book? Baha'i community has a pretty strong cultural and artistic tradition, mm. which stems from some of its core teachings. Poetry is described as a way of pulling out truths from the world. Painting is described as prayer. Music is a ladder. For Music is a ladder. It's all beautiful, yeah. I think the book is meant to be somewhere between the coffee table and the library. It's supposed to be something that's beautiful mm -hmm. to look at. People who think they know a lot about the topic yeah. may come away with some su surprising information. One of the key challenges has been the persecution of Baha'is, particularly in Iran. Mm -hmm. And currently, um, there's denial of civil rights to Baha'is in Iran. Does the book deal with concepts of, of God and concepts of atheism? As a religion, we don't believe God can be proved scientifically or, you know, there's any even philosophical proof of God. It's a very respectful religion. It's, it's not a fight. Is there something in the Baha'i faith that if it's a fight, you're both wrong? That's, that's marriage counselling, isn't it? I think so, yes. <laughs> I just learned one thing, I'm wrong. I have to say, this is a fantastic book. I'm, I'm very proud to be included in it. I also will say that um, all of us are actually the same age. I don't know if you can see this. Um, the look here we have of, you know, chic. I, my look is sphere. It's a great book. <laughs> I can't help it. Let's start again. I'll go for a drink or? Dinner. Dinner? Yeah. Tell us about your uh, bronze medal in women's archery.